Hey guys, Mixed Media Girl here. So in this video, I am creating some resin and alcohol ink Petri dish coasters. These are so easy to make. So I start off with some clear resin and then use 91% isopropyl alcohol to get rid of any air bubbles. You could also use a heat gun. The alcohol inks themselves will also help to remove air bubbles. So don't stress about it too much unless you have just a ton of air bubbles. Once you've done that, go ahead and just start putting in your colors. You can use whatever colors you want and you can use as many colors as you want. I do recommend layering the uh, pinata white alcohol ink in between your colors. It will help create some amazing depth, but otherwise use any alcohol inks you want. I'm using a combination of Ranger and pinata inks for these and just going pretty wild on the colors and using basically all of them. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and just throw some music behind this part for you guys and just have fun watching all the reactions occur. Once you're done with your colors, just go ahead and let these fully dry. Uh, it depends on the resin you're using, but this should take about 24 hours or so. And then we will be back to demold these. All right, these are now completely dry. So I'm gonna go ahead and peel them out of the molds and show you guys both sides. So you can see the crazy fun reactions that we had on that other side. This is the top and then here's the bottom. The great thing about these coasters is they can be used on either side. So whichever side you like more, you can go ahead and use that side. You can also do these in layers if you want. Just don't fill the whole thing in with resin to start with. So super fun and easy project. Hope you enjoyed it. See you next time.